Praise the Lord. This message and title is uh, Christmas. What's so great, great about it? I'm going to, uh, I'm going to talk to uh, you on uh, Christmas, and um, and also uh, we will we will see that in a in a in a probably a new uh, new way, a new approach uh, uh, to. Um, to our uh, uh, to to Christmas, basically. I want you to turn to Psalm uh, Psalm 106. Psalm 106. It's a, it's a pretty long portion, but uh, we will uh, we will spend time uh, spend some time in uh, bits and pieces. However, I want to uh, tell you something. Uh, um, I ask you a question. What happens when you pray? నువ్వు ప్రార్థన చేసినప్పుడు ఏం జరుగుతుంది వాట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ వెన్ యూ డూ సమ్ సమ్ గుడ్ థింగ్ టు ఆనర్ గాడ్ వాట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ ఏం జరుగుతుంది నువ్వు దేవుడి కోసం ఒక ఒక మంచి పని దేవుడిని ఘనపరచడానికి ఒక పని చేసినప్పుడు ఏం జరుగుతుంది వాట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ రైట్ వి విల్ వి విల్ లుక్ ఇన్ టు దీస్ ఆస్పెక్ట్స్ ఐ వాంట్ టు రీడ్ అ ఫ్యూ పోర్షన్స్ యాక్చువల్లీ అండ్ అండ్ దెన్ కమ్ uh this revelation is uh, given to my wife so uh, i'm i'm going to share that with you with, with you uh psalm 106 uh, verse uh, 19 onwards we will read they made a calf in horeb and worshiped the molded image thus they changed the glory of god into an image of an ox that eats grass they forgot god their savior who had done great things in egypt wondrous works in the land of am awesome things by the red sea seven prakash listen uh, i'm telling you god remembers the place devudu pradeshanni gurtunchukuntadu ee pradeshamlo neeku em jarigindha anedi enmi tanu chesada anedi nuve em chesava anedi devudu gurtunchukuntadu jagratga vindam manam chadu horebulo varu doodanu cheyinchukonedi ఎక్కడ హోరేబులో వారు దూడను చేయించుకుని హి రిమెంబర్ ద ప్లేస్ ఓకే పోత పోసిన విగ్రహమునకు నమస్కారం చేసిరి తమ మహిమాస్పద మహిమాస్పదమును గడ్డమేమి ఏయు ఎద్దు రూపమునకు మార్చిరి ఐగుప్తులో గొప్ప కార్యములను హాము దేశంలో ఆశ్చర్య కార్యములను ఎర్ర సముద్రమును ఎక్కడెక్కడ ఎక్కడెక్కడ ఐజిప్తులో ఐగుప్తులో గొప్ప కార్యములను మళ్ళీ ప్రదేశాన్ని గుర్తుంచుకున్నాడు దాని తర్వాత ఆమె దేశంలో ఆశ్చర్య కార్యము ల్యాండ్ ఆఫ్ హ్యామ్ హి రిమెంబర్స్ ద ప్లేస్ రైట్ ఎర్ర సముద్రము నుండ భయంకర క్రియములను చేసిన తమ రక్షకుడైన దేవుని మర్చిపోయి సి హి రిమెంబర్స్ ద ప్లేస్ అప్పుడు ఆయన నేను వారిని నశింప చేసేదన నేను అయితే ఆయన వారిని నశింప చేయకున్నట్లు ఆయన కోపము చల్లాచుటకై ఆయన ఏర్పరచుకున్న వేయే మోసే ఆయన సన్నిధిని నిలిచి అట్టుపడెను right therefore he said that, that uh, he would destroy them had not moses his chosen one stood before him in the breach had not the moses his chosen one stood in the breach stood before him in the breach ekkada nilabaddadu mose mose ekkada nilabaddadu appudu ayana nenu varini ashimpa chesedanu aithe ayana నశింప చేయింట్లో ఆయన కోపం చల్లాచటకాయ ఆయన ఏర్పరచుకున్న మోసే ఆయన సన్నిధిని నిల్చాను ఆయన సన్నిధిలో నిల్చాను నవ్ దేవుడు ఏం చెప్పాడు ఈ ప్రజలను నేను నాశనం చేస్తాను ఐ డిస్ట్రాయ్ దిస్ 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 పీపుల్ దెన్ మోసెస్ స్టుడ్ బిట్వీన్ గాడ్ అండ్ హిస్ పీపుల్ రైట్ గాడ్ అండ్ ద పీపుల్ హీ స్టుడ్ ఇక్కడ చూడండి ఐ వాంట్ యూ టు అబ్జర్వ్ దిస్ what happens when you pray nu prarthana chesinappudu em em avutundi nuvu evari kosamaina nu prarthana chestunappudu okallu paapamlo unnaru right there is somebody who is in sin there is somebody something is wrong he is not able to pray right and then you are coming and standing in uh, in the breach a gap lo nu nilabadutunavu what happens when you stand in the crack in the gap see you are ipudu he moses is standing between god and uh, the people and he is telling god you not going to do this idi nu cheyagu nuvu nuvu rakshinchina janangam idi this is these are the people whom you brought out of egypt what will people say right these are the things that god moses is standing in the gap 
and then uh, speaking uh, uh, speaking uh, speaking to god remember this is what happens when you when you pray what are you doing when you pray na devuniki devuniki dan tarvata or unko vidhanga cheptanu paristhitulaki parinamalaki dan tarvata evaraithe aa paristhitilo unnaro dani parinamala parinamalu unnayo vaati madhyalo nuvu nilabadutunna what happens is you are standing between the person and the consequences and you are lifting up your hands you are lifting up your voice and then you are praying to god and uh, and uh, why you are, why you are doing this you are preventing the consequences to take control of his life this is what you are doing please understand this church so remember any prayer small or big it's not small at all in the sight of god in the sight of the in the realm of god దేవుడి అక్కడ అక్కడ ఆత్మ పరిధిలో అవి ఏ ప్రార్థన కూడా చిన్నది కాదు నెవ నో ప్రేయర్ రిమెంబర్ నెహమయా హ్యాడ్ నో టైమ్ రైట్ హీ జస్ట్ ప్రే డెస్ ఇట్ గాడ్ హెల్ప్ మీ అండ్ దెన్ హీ హీ ఆన్సర్డ్ ద క్వశ్చన్ ఆఫ్ ద కింగ్ అండ్ దట్ చేంజ్డ్ లాడ్ ఆఫ్ థింగ్స్ ఇన్ జెరూసలం ఇట్ చేంజ్ ద హార్ట్ రిమెంబర్ వెన్ ఎవర్ యు ఆర్ ప్రేయింగ్ ప్రే విత్ కాన్ఫిడెన్స్ pray with confidence that number 1 you are praying to god right number 2 he has already prepared those things what did jesus say no prarthana cheyatan kante mundara nenu adi naaku telusu nu den gurinchi ayithe prarthana chestunavo i know what you are going to ask i know that means he has prepared the hearts of people he has prepared the con- the the uh, he has prepared the uh the situations he is prepared he is having things under his control and now when you are praying he wants to grant it to you right that is why remember have confidence come boldly into the presence of god why because you should know that he has he is already knows what what you are going to ask him and then he has prepared things for you for you and to answer answer you right that's why when you when you when you are going he is already prepared he's already prepared like satish was testifying shubha was test- testifying right this is the desire and then he has prepared that for you right he has prepared that for you the first time when you asked him or when you desired that i want this car i want this vehicle i want a good health i want to serve you remember and then what happens is he gives you the desire of his heart ni hrudaya vaanchalanu teerche devudani devudu devudu vaakyam cheptundi nu prarthana cheyaledu kaani vaancha undi neeku god i desire i desire it or you desired something god has heard your desire has heard your desire right those who fear the lord will have desires according to what pleases god ఎవరైతే దేవుడి భయము కలిగి ఉంటారో వాళ్ళు దేవుడి వాక్యానుసారంగా దేవుడి ఇష్టాల ఇష్టానుసారంగా వాళ్ళ కోరికల్ని కూడా వాళ్ళు మలుచుకుంటారు కాబట్టి వాళ్ళ ఇష్టాలు దేవుడి జవాబు రెండు ఒకేలాగుంటాయి రైట్ సో దట్ ఈస్ దట్ ఈస్ వై వెన్ ఎవర్ యు ఆర్ ప్రేయింగ్ వెన్ ఎవర్ యు ఆర్ లిజనింగ్ టు ద వర్డ్ ఆఫ్ గాడ్ వెన్ ఎవర్ యు ఆర్ డిజైరింగ్ టు ఫాలో గాడ్ రిమెంబర్ వన్ థింగ్ గాడ్ చేంజ్ మై డిజైర్స్ టు దాట్ విచ్ ప్లీజ్ యూ why because everything that pleases god everything you are offering it in prayer he is ready to answer so how good it is when you change your desires when you ask god to change your desires from within how beautiful that prayer is enta baaguntundi enta oka parimalla dhoopanga tanaki untundi eppudu na korikalani na vaanchalani na hrudaya vaanchalani nu marchu nik ishtam niku ishtamuga unde laaga nu marchu ani cheppinappudu enta how beautiful is that prayer right how beautiful is that prayer now we will look into a similar person right he is not very famous in the bible right but he he did something that uh, that you will see we'll continue psalm 106 um, 24 varu ramyamaina deshamunu nirakarinchiri ayana maata nammakapoyiri yehova maata aalakimpaka varu tama gudaramulo sanugukoniri all right we'll read from 28 onwards we will read they joined themselves also to baal of your right malli ikkada bal and pradesham gurinchi akkada maatladutunnadu remember what happened and eight sacrifices made to the dead thus they provoked him to anger with their uh, with their with their deeds and the plague broke out among them akkada emaindi tegulu antukundi akkada right and then something happened then phineas stood up and intervened phineas ane vyakti em chesadu akkada addukunnadu right and plague was stopped and that was accounted to him for righteousness to all generations forevermore akade mundi chudachalandi mariyu varu bel 
బయల్బయారును హత్తుకొని చచ్చిన వారికి అర్పించిన బలి మాంసమును పూజించిరి వారు తమ క్రియల చేత ఆయన కోపం పుట్టింపగా వారిలో తెగులు రేగెను ఫినిహాసు లేచి పరిహారం చేయగా ఫినిహాసు లేచి పరిహారం చేయగా పరిహారం చేశాడు ఆ తెగులు ఆగిపోయాను ఆ తెగులు ఆగిపోయాను నిత్యము తర తరతముల నిత్యము తరములన్నింటి అతనికి ఆ పని నీతిగా ఎంచబడేను అతనికి ఆ పని నీతిగా పని నీతిగా ఎంచబడేను ఇంకొకసారి ఎక్కడ రాస్తుంది ఆయన ఆయన ఆ నమ్మకము అది ఆయనకు నీతిగా ఎంచబడని ఎక్కడ రాస్తుంది విశ్వాసము అక్కడ అబ్రహాము ఇన్న పాల్గొనిన ఇద్దరిని వాడు ఏం చేస్తాడు ఆ బళ్ళెం తీసుకుని ఇద్దరిలో దింపేస్తాడు that means he stopped the sin that is going on in in israel with one javelin angel said is going to start otherwise if you if you don't if you don't go stop it right stop it why because this will lead to a plague right where everyone will be affected so stop that and that is what that is what he did and atuvanti pani meeru chesthe ganaka if you do such kind of work silently don't think nobody is watching god is watching what is happening god credits to your account righteousness neeti nee account lo tanu jama chestadu how beautiful is that any small work that you do for god remember he honors it he remembers the place he remembers what you have done and then as a result he credits then what is happening see what happened and that was accounted to him for righteousness to all generations forevermore right that means your fruit will be blessed your fruit your generations will be blessed what you are doing is by doing a righteous act for god to god what is happening number one righteousness is being credited into your account two you are putting righteousness righteousness into your account your account is increasing increasing and no one can take this from you no one can take this that is that is what i want you to keep on growing praise you right remember righteousness peace and joy in the holy spirit is complete satisfaction that is satisfaction there is no other thing that can satisfy you more than the kingdom not just one thing two things will happen the red sea will uh, the red sea will part and the enemies will die both will happen so edo okati jarugutundi ya 50% discount anedi kadu right there is no discount when god is giving you or ministering deliverance to you there is no discount it is 100% right so god has a habit of splitting it right then what uh, what what happens can you tell any other time when uh, when things split into two give an example let's see is one i gave you right is there any other example when god stepped in and then and then the curtain was tore into two right why again for deliverance the third thing that i want to talk about christmas is as uh, when god stepped in the time split into two samayamu emaindi rendu paayaluga vidipoyindi christ purvamu christ shakamu right it is bc and ad what is bc stands for i told you before bc stands for before christ ad stands for ad stands for what ad ante enti anno domini right the year of the lord we are in 2020th year of the lord right it is not after death what happens if you say after death ad ante after death ante after death ante em avutundi is wrong okay let's say ad what is wrong when uh, when you say ad when you say ad it is wrong after death when you say it is after death it is wrong because then you will lose 33 and a half years in the calendar that's the time that jesus between B- jesus's birth and death then you will lose that time a calendar will lose 33 and a half years that is why it is not the it is not after death it is anno domini the year of the lord christu purvamu christu shakamu right that is the, that is what majlo chachipothe kirti seshal avtaru so uh, that is that is a different thing so um, this is what happened samayamu evarlo aithe undo aina samayamloki adugu pettinappudu samayamu rendu paayaluga chilipoyindi in whom 
the time exists that person in whom time is there that person when he stepped into time time split in any country that you go i've shared this before in any country that you go the time is recorded as before christ and after christ whether they believe in jesus christ or not when it comes to time time is divided into two right before and after christ it doesn't really matter i also want to tell uh um no, no, this uh, this uh, probably i'll share a uh, share a uh, uh, bit uh, a bit a bit later uh, tell tell uh, tell tell something on uh, 18 to 23 matthew 1 18 to 23 why is it uh, can you answer why is it that uh, it is uh, it is anno uh, domini or uh, the year of the lord why is it uh, why is it said it is said because once you are born again before and after christ the moment you are born again the death you have overcome death right so the since there is no end it is going to be the year after year and into eternity right and okay what does jesus say in uh, uh, in um, in john 173 he says this is eternal life what is eternal life to know you god and to know me whom you have sent this is eternal life the moment you come to know jesus christ remember your life divides in anu nee jeevithamlo adugu pettinappudu appudu kuda nee jeevitham rendu paayiluga vedipothundi your life actually breaks into two before christ and you, whether you are in christ or not once you know the truth right your your life itself is now divided into two nee jeevitham kuda rendu paayiluga vedipoyindi christu christu purvamu christu christuni christuni telusukunnaaka now you are you, your life is there remember this life is uh, of a, of a, of high value that's why now we will read uh, matthew uh, matthew 118 onwards so christmas is not about just uh, good food uh, uh, and uh, good good drinks and uh, um, and uh, uh, good offers that are going on in amazon and uh, other places online and uh, rest of rest of the things it's just not about that it's 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 one thing is whether it is not about whether uh, uh, jesus was born on 25th uh, december or not is a is a different thing when jesus was born the time split in, split into two right so uh, let's we will come and study uh, the date on which he was born because we can zero down onto the date which was uh, which was born because uh, uh, of various things we will uh, that's a different uh, uh, sermon altogether so uh, matthew 1 18 onwards now birth of uh, jesus uh, christ was as follows after his mother mary was betrothed to joseph before they came together she was found with the child of the holy spirit remember underline that line if you want to uh, she was found with child of the holy spirit then joseph her husband being a just man and not wanting to make her a public example was minded to put her away secretly but while he thought about these things behold an angel of the lord appeared to him in a dream saying joseph son of david do not be afraid to take uh, uh, to take you mary your wife for that which is underline these words conceived in her is of the holy spirit why am i asking you to underline these things because these are important and she will bring forth the son and you shall call his name jesus for he will save his people from their sins so all this was done that it might be fulfilled which was spoken by the lord through the prophet isaiah right saying behold the virgin shall be with the child and bear a son and they shall call his name emmanuel uh, which is translated god with us so uh, what does uh, what does uh, this what does this all mean idi e nepadhyamlo jarigindi what is the background of this prophecy Do, does anyone know what is the background of this prophecy the background of this prophecy is is, is this king ahaz had uh, uh, was the king ruling judah at that time and uh, he was planning to have a secret deal conspiracy with uh, uh, there are two kingdoms that time syria and assyria right he was trying to have a conspiracy during that uh, that time in that in that time um isaiah comes to ahaz and gives this prophecy what does this give what is the prophecy mean a pravachanam enti what is the prophecy he says he says uh, this shall be a sign that a virgin will give birth right and you shall call him jesus right this is the prophecy a virgin will will be. now 
This prophecy did not take place till 740 years. It didn't take place. What does this mean to Ahaz and to the rest of the Israelites? How will, how will that be? God tells you something. God tells you a sign. They, he told, he told, uh, 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 he told the apostles that he's coming back. Right? He's coming back. He told the apostles. They had a divine revelation that he's coming, coming back. But he didn't come for 2,000 years. He didn't come. He didn't come for the church. They talked about the rapture of the church. Right? It didn't happen. Today we are still here. The church, rapture has not taken place. How is it? How is it? Listen to this very carefully. What it means is, when a prophet comes and speaks to the king, he comes and he gives the prophecy, a virgin shall give birth. Right? There is, the salvation is going to come through the Jews. What does this, this mean? Until he comes, nothing is going to happen to you. Until the prophecy is fulfilled, no one can touch Israel. Nothing will happen to you. No Israel ni, edo aipo tundi, walandaru champesna rani, ankuntu nao, nubu koda Israel ni, amme yal ankuntu nao. Devudu chepthu nadu, jaragadadi. This is what it means. Apostles understood it very well. The world, the, the whole world is going to, going to, uh, is, is, in, is in a chaos. Every, every, there is a lot of sin that is grow, growing in the church. What's the prophecy? Christ will come. Right? He will come. There will be a millennial rule. And that is why Bible also tells, every knee will bow. Every tongue will confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. It doesn't matter whether you are a believer or not. You will bow. You will bow. So, this prophecy, all the prophecies in the Bible, you can take this and then, and then tell, this is going to happen. That's why I will change my life. Please understand this. Manamu sabarinch kogalamu. We can correct what has, what has happened. You can't rewrite your past. Only thing that can happen to your past is it needs to be forgiven if it is not according to God. And then washed in the blood of Jesus Christ. Otherwise, your past remains. Your past will remain as a proof of a proof or for judgment. The reason is it is not forgiven or it is not washed by the blood of Jesus and it is not washed by the blood of Jesus Christ. When it does, judgment passes over you. Tirpu ninnu dati velli potundi niku tagal kunda. So please, please remember that is the power of prophecy. He has the need to and need should have understood that when the prophecy is being spoken, until that time, until that time, nothing is going to happen. So even today, the prophecies of the Bible are that Jesus is going to come, right? He's going to come again the second time. Right? The mountain on which he is going to stand is going to split into two, even then. Right? The mount, mount that he is coming on, the moment his, his uh, legs are going to touch, the mountain is going to split into two. Right? So please, please understand this. So that is the reason why, as we are the priests, called to be the priests, in order of Melchizedek, not according to the order of Levit, uh, Levites. Right? We are in that order. So please understand, I'll tell more about that in, uh, in, in another, another, time, another time. But because you are a priest, right? pray that God steps into somebody's life so that the time, their life is split into two. Right? That needs to happen, church, every time when you pray. And I'm glad Shubha has taken up her calling and uh, Prakash, uh, they are praying and they are seeing the intervention of God. Right? Intervention of God. I want more testimonies like this. For the honor of God. I want to say, I have prayed, God intervened, their life is split into two. Right? Before the miracle, after the miracle. Right? Before, how were they? Now, after that, they are, they are answerable. Whether they will be faithful to God or not. That needs to be, that needs to be done. So, we will continue. So, this happened. This is the, this is the sign that was given to a, a, a pravachanamu palakatanki, pal, palaka, 
ఎప్పుడైతే అది దేవుడు బయలుపరిచాడో దాని నేపథ్యం చెప్పాను మీకు ఐ టోల్డ్ యూ ద బ్యాక్గ్రౌండ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఆఫ్ ద ప్రాఫసీ దట్ ఈస్ వెన్ ద ప్రాఫసీ వాజ్ వాజ్ సో ఇఫ్ ఎ వర్డ్ ఈస్ గివెన్ టు యూ ఇఫ్ ఎ ప్రామిస్ ఈస్ గివెన్ టు యూ రైట్ రిమెంబర్ రిమెంబర్ దాట్ దాట్ విల్ బీ ఫుల్ఫిల్ దెన్ యువర్ లైఫ్ రైట్ God has seen you in that year he has seen you now the pro- the promise a wonderful uh, uh, amazing promise god has given for 2021 which i'll be sharing to you remember when he has spoken that when he has given you the promise he has seen the year through ana samachranni nuvu e vidhanga aithe nee jeevitham gadichindo adi chusadu thanu right and then he has given you the prophecy so that you can hold on to that prophecy and walk through that life walk through that బికాస్ ఆయన ఎప్పుడు ఎప్పుడు నీకు ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ వన్ కి ప్రామిస్ ఇవ్వటం కంటే ముందర ఆయన ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ టూ డిసెంబర్ థర్టీ ఫస్ట్ రోజు నిలబడి నీకు ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ వన్ ప్రామిస్ నీకు ఫస్ట్ జనవరి రోజు ఇస్తున్నాడు నాట్ నాట్ దట్ హీస్ గివింగ్ యూ ఫస్ట్ జాన్ ఆన్ ఫస్ట్ జనవరి ట్వంటీ టూ హీ హెస్ క్రాస్ దట్ ఐఎమ్ నాట్ టెలింగ్ యూ ఇన్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ వన్ హీస్ ఇన్ ఇటర్నిటీ బట్ ఐఎమ్ టెలింగ్ యూ హీ హెస్ క్రాస్ దట్ సీన్ యూ త్రూ గేవ్ యూ దట్ ప్రాఫసీ సో వాట్ హ్యాపెన్స్ ఇస్ దిస్ విల్ బీ ఫుల్ఫిల్డ్ అగేన్స్ట్ ఆల్ సర్కమ్స్టాన్సెస్ right that is how you need to understand prophecy ee vidhanga manamu pravachanam ni ardham cheskovali devudu maatladatam tarvai then it stands because he cannot lie aina abaddham cheppadu evaru marchagaltaru who can change the circumstances you and i by not believing it right we can move away from god the most of the time what happens is we move away from the prophecy and then we call god a liar మనము ప్రవచనం దేవుడు పలికిన వాక్యం నుంచి మనము పక్కకి పక్కకి నడిచి వెనకు తిరిగి దేవుణ్ణి అబద్ధికుడుగా మనం నిరూపించడానికి చూస్తుంటాము విచ్ ఇస్ అ నాట్ అ గుడ్ ఐడియా సో వాట్స్ గ్రేట్ అబౌట్ క్రిస్మస్ వాట్స్ వాట్స్ సో గ్రేట్ అబౌట్ క్రిస్మస్ ద క్రియేటర్ హూ వాజ్ ఇన్ టైమ్ స్టెప్ ఇన్ టు టైమ్ స్ప్లిట్ ఇట్ ఇన్ టు టూ స్టెప్ ఇన్ టు యువర్ లైఫ్ స్ప్లిట్ ఇట్ ఇన్ టు టూ టూ అండ్ వై బికాస్ హీ వాంట్స్ అ టెస్ట్ మనీ ఫర్ యూ రైట్ హీ వాంట్స్ యూ టు బి అ టెస్ట్ మనీ హీ వాంట్స్ యూ టు బి అ టెస్ట్ మనీ the second thing great that is great about uh, christmas is god became man you know devudu manushiga vachadu again i'm telling you this time because many people are going to ask you questions speak to them and tell them why christmas is uh, great right why it's, it's great again i'm not talking about the date 25th of december i'm not talking about christmas as a as a as a uh, as a festival that's not what i'm talking about i'm talking about the birth of christ what's so great about it this is uh, this is great right so god became that's why christmas changes everything right the birth of christ again when i say christmas it's birth of christ the christmas changes everything the whole world whole world counted down to christ right he they counted down to christ atla how did they count down to christ let's say 4000 4000 bc dan tarvata 3000 bc dan tarvata 1000 bc right then zero right it is when christ came after that it is it is it is what ad right after that now we are in 2020 uh, 20 20 ad this conti- this 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 continues so this is this is where christ was born this is the birth of christ it is the it is the first christmas if you want to write uh, uh, that way this is the first christmas this is the first christmas that divides into two appudu varaku the world came the, the time came we counted back down to uh, the, we counted it down and after that we count it up why now christ has come why akadu varaku the christ was coming down right he was coming down to the earth now he, we are all going up right whoever believed see the difference that is how we need to we need to take we count it up because we are going up right whoever believes in him we going going up here and the idea is we look up i said it's time it's is coming he's he's coming it's not about second coming it's about uh, he's coming in mid air and then we joining him that is uh, that is what is the event the whole world is uh, is uh, uh, see the argument about jesus christ all through what is the argument about jesus, jesus christ is that he was a prophet he was uh, he was a good man right he was a, he was a prophet uh, he was a messenger uh, etc and uh, that's wrong right we all know as believers that's absolutely wrong he was god he is god he will always be god right there is no changing in that jesus is 100% god 
and uh, let there not be any change uh, change in that that is what you and i must believe idi nammal manamu aina devudu aina devudu aina devudu ante there is there is no change in that see uh, matthew 16 verses uh, uh, 13 to 16 we will read matthew 16 13 to 16 when jesus came to cesarea philippi he asked his disciples saying who do men say that i am who do men say that i the son of man am so they the, so they said some say john the baptist some say elijah some are the others jeremiah or one of the prophets he said to them but who do you say that i am valandaru cheppedi pakkana pettu nuve em cheptunam i'm telling you church please understand this it's not about who says jesus christ is lord who says jesus christ is savior what do you say you need to have a personal confession about jesus christ prathi okkaliki vyaktigata oppukodala oppukotamu antu undali what is your personal confession about christ what is it what is it what is it who do you say who do you say that uh, that uh, jesus christ is ee prashna christu manalni adugute manam e vidhanga jawab cheptam what what will you ask remember you can't tell a lie right so what is your personal testimony about jesus christ see uh i shared this recently also uh, uh and i shared it many times in 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 the church if you don't have a personal testimony uh, a, a personal confession about jesus christ your your life and my life will keep varying right it will keep oksari will be up the other will be down up and down and up and down right roller coaster laga untundi adi if you if you have a personal testimony about jesus christ then what happens is your life and my life will change because remember this question this answer changes your destiny ee jawabu mana gamyanni maarustundi mana gamyanni maarustundi destiny right who do you say jesus christ is and uh, what did uh, what did peter say bless his heart what is he what does he say he says uh, he says you are the christ the son of the living god he says on this what do you say on this revelation right i will build my church and no gates of hell will be able to stand against them on this i will build build the church because remember on the revelation that you have about jesus christ he is going to build your life and your ministry nuvu ni oppukotam edaithe undo neeku christu ni goorchina pratyakshata oppukotam edaithe neeku vyaktigatanga undo daan meeda ni jeevithanni ni paricharyani yesu kadtadu is your confession is your confession good that christ can build his church on your confession nee oppukodam ela undali ante enta anukulanga undali ante christu tana sanghanni dani meeda katteyanta anukulanga undali i will build your ministry if you have a wrong confession you have a wrong ministry that you will do if you have a wrong confession a wrong life you will you will do because why because you are you are denying christ you have a different revelation about a different jesus christ who's not who's going to but paul writes it very clearly there will be messages spoken about another jesus gospel about another jesus ministry of another holy spirit right this is what that it will be so which jesus are you confessing that jesus is going to build your life and your ministry ఏ క్రీస్తునైతే నువ్వు అబద్ధపు క్రీస్తులు అబద్ధపు అబద్ధపు సువార్త అబద్ధపు పరిశుద్ధాత్మ గురించి నువ్వు మాట్లాడితే అబద్ధపు అబద్ధికుడు నీ పరిచర్యని నీ జీవితాన్ని కడుతుంటాడు వై యు ఆర్ కన్ఫెసింగ్ హిమ్ యాజ్ అ లార్డ్ అండ్ సేవియర్ హీఈస్ గోన్ టు బిల్డ్ యువర్ లైఫ్ బట్ ఇఫ్ యూ కన్ఫెస్ ద క్రైస్ట్ హూమ్ ద బైబుల్ ప్రీచర్స్ హూమ్ క్రైస్ట్ ఇస్ రివీల్డ్ బై ద బై బై గాడ్ హీఈస్ గోన్ టు బిల్డ్ యువర్ లైఫ్ హీఈస్ గోన్ టు బిల్డ్ యువర్ మినిస్ట్రీ బికాస్ ఎందుకు ప్రభు అనే ఆయనని ఒప్పుకుంటున్నావు ఎవరినైతే నువ్వు ప్రభువుగా ఒప్పుకుంటున్నావో ఆయన నీ జీవితాన్ని నీ పరిచర్యని కడతాడు సో రిమెంబర్ ఇట్స్ యువర్ కన్ఫెషన్ అబౌట్ క్రైస్ట్ ఇస్ వెరీ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ వెరీ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ హీ వాస్ కన్సీవ్డ్ బై ద హోలీ స్పిరిట్ హీ వాస్ కన్సీవ్డ్ బై ద హోలీ స్పిరిట్ ఎందుకంత ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఆయన మరియ పరిశుద్ధాత్మ ద్వారా గర్భం దాల్చింది అనేది చెప్పటము ఎందుకు ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఐ విల్ టెల్ యూ ఇట్ ఈస్ వెరీ ఇంపార్టెంట్ టు నో దిస్ and uh, it is very important to uh, know this i will i will just tell you remember science uh, we will talk about it right this is an this is an egg and uh, uh, and this is a this is a this is a sperm right this is an this is an egg now the woman has an egg and uh, the uh, the the father 
has the seed. The father has the seed. You should remember that very, very clearly and uh, very, very well. So the vessel was there, but uh, it is the spirit of God. That is why, church, please understand this. You are born again by the incorruptible seed. Nuvu, nuvu. You are born with the uncorruptible seed. Why? Because you are born of the word and of the spirit. That is why you are born again is, uh, is, uh, is, is what is immaculate. That means perfect, pure, if you have confessed it really. So what, happens to, what happened to Mary was, what did she say? What did Mary receive? What did Mary receive? He, she received the word, right? She received the word. She said, so it, let it be done according to, I am God's, I am the Lord's handmaid. Be it done to you according to what you said. What you spoke, I received. Right? And then what, what, what happened? Her conception and the, when the word and the spirit come together, there is a miracle that takes place. Right? That is exactly what has happened. Why? Why it is important to know this because iniquities come through the fathers and not through the mothers. Doshamu edete untundo adi bijamu dwara adi unko generation ki osundi kabati akada angel gindi adi undakudu doshamu undakudu kabati parshudhatma devud dwara ab maria garbham dal chal siwachindi. This is the story of Christmas. God chose to become a man. Right? And I'm telling you, church, why it is important. Uh, this, this may, if it, the mothers may think, right? We have mothers here. They may think, right? Nak telsu, chedu alwat lanni, thandi deganu chauche, na deganu jain rale. Right? I have a proof also to, I'll give you, I'll give you proof, which is, which is true. Right? In one way, this is true. Uh, uh, if, if you want a scripture, I can give you for that. I think it is a, a De Deuteronomy 5, 9. Right? Deuteronomy 5.9. Mothers, yeah, in one way you can be happy, right? Two, uh, men, you need to be careful, right? Those, especially those who are planning for a child and will have a child soon. Uh, you, need to, you, need, you need to plan well. Um, you need to plan well. Family planning, right? You need to plan well that before I have a child, God, I don't want any iniquity to pass on, right? Men, this is what we have to do. Uh, you have to do. I'm past that, so. You have to do. So Deuteronomy 5, 9. You shall not bow down to them and serve them. For I, the Lord, your God, am a jealous God visiting the iniquities of the fathers upon the children. Visiting the iniquities of the father upon the children to the third and to the fourth generations of those who hate me. So remember this. So it's a, it's a nice thing. So what happened to Mary? Whether Mary understood all this or not, she said, God, thank you. I said, I receive your word. And uh, that is all in simplicity he has uh, received. Christlo na saralatvan dwara manamu goppa karyal chechu, goppa jivitani manamu jivin chechu. So he was born of the incorruptible seed. Remember, uh, uh, why, is this why is this important? Why is this important? Because uh, he had to be fully God and fully a uh, human being, fully, fully man. See, the, uh, the deity of uh, humanity of Jesus Christ uh, is God became a human being, right? That's the deity. This should not be forgotten, right? This is the beautiful aspect of Christmas when you want to explain it. See, religion, I told you many times, religion is a man's attempt to know God, Christianity. Right? I hate to call it a religion. Christianity is God's, God's attempt to reach man. Right? So which is good? Religion or relationship? Right? So uh, that, is, that is what? So he was born of the incorruptible seed. Right? Jesus was born of that. You were covered when you were born. Everyone who is born, you were covered in the, in the, in the blood of your mother. Right? In the, you were covered in the blood when you came into this earth. You are covered in the blood, right? Unless you are a test tube baby, right? Otherwise, you are covered in the blood of, uh, of, of the parents. The important is when you are born again, you are also covered in the blood, right? This time, one blood 
brought you into the earth, the other blood will take you to eternity. Difference is that. Difference is one blood brought you to this earth. The blood of the Father, right, will take you to the heaven, right, to stay with him forever. That is why his blood is important. His blood. Uncorruptible blood, incorruptible blood, that is important for this reason, right? This is the beauty of Christmas. Want everyone to know this. 1 Peter 2.23. 1 Peter 1.23 uh, will, will tell, having been born again, not of, the incorrupt, not of the corruptible seed, but incorruptible through the word of God which lives and abides forever. It, it is, uh, the, this is uh, what uh, is uh, the great thing about Christmas church. This is what, if someone asks you, what is so great about Christmas? Tell them, this is a great thing about Christmas. This is the great thing about, uh, about, about Christmas. See, God did not send a messenger. He did not send a messenger. Right? Because message could be given in a different way. He did not. He brought the message himself. He brought the message himself. That is, the, that is, that is, that is great. He did not send someone to redeem you. What did he do? He came himself to redeem you. This is the great thing about, uh, about Christmas. I, I told you an, an example. God, though he is sovereign, all-powerful, all-knowing, cannot dismiss a sin. Papa Nitanu cancel Chayaladu. Though he is God. Right? Why? Because he is a righteous God. If he is an unrighteous God, then he can cancel or dismiss sin. A righteous God, because the guilt is committed, he will pay for it. He has to pay for it. The wages of sin is death. Right? That is why he had to come and pay and redeem us. So never, under, uh, never, never you are forgiven because you believe in Jesus Christ who died on the cross and then who, 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 were, who was buried and who rose again and that he carried all my sins on the cross. He died on my behalf. That is why your sins are forgiven. Otherwise your sins will and my sins will remain until they are judged. Why? Because the God is a, a righteous God. He's a righteous God. And okay? any other religion, any other religion for that matter, who does not, who which does not offer, right, the payment of sin, can never lead you to God. Can never lead you. How can you cancel? Cancel. Guilt has been committed. How can you cancel? It has to be forgiven and paid for. So this is what Jesus did. This is the church. This is the beauty of uh, Christmas. So many things, uh, many, many people think that God can dismiss charges. God can dismiss the sin. He will not dismiss the sin. He will not dismiss the sin. Right? So if anyone asks you what's so great about Christmas, tell them. Right? We serve a God who split the time into two. Right? Who split me into two. Right? Why does he split that into two? He does not want enemy to overcome you. Shatruvu ninnu akraminch ko kunda vadi somtam chesko kunda undatan ke thannu ni jeevitan lo adugu betti ni jeevitan ni rundituka vivajisthada. Kristu purvamu, Kristu shakamu. You are, the past is taken care of, it's past. And what you are living is in the ear of the Lord, it will continue. This won't change. Ikada ending leed din ke. There is no, that is why it is not after that, it is Anno Domini, the year of the Lord. Right? Amen? We'll pray. We'll pray. We, we serve a beautiful God. We serve a beautiful God. Remember the story of Phineas. Remember, everything that you confess, everything that you pray, everything that you do, God remembers the place, God remembers what you have done, and then He wants us to do Follow righteousness. Jesus angel said, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. Righteousness is not apart from the kingdom. Neeti devundi rajan nunchi vera inna di kaadu. Kani neeti meeda enduku tanu stress sunchitu nadu adi adi dhani vembadi nchman endu kandu nadu vante. That will keep you standing in the presence of God. That will keep you standing in the presence of God. So church, understand this. Follow 
do good thing bible also tells tells us do not be become weary doing good no manchi chestu alisipovaddu ani devudi devudi vakyam cheptundi enduku nu manchi chestunna koddi devudu nee nee account lo thanu credit cheskuntu velthunadu he wants to credit this every act remember take the story of phinehas and then say god this is mine and to every this is a, this will serve as a strength also why because when you uh, when 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 you do the work you know it is being credited as righteousness to you that should motivate you nenu chese prati manchi kriyani devudu eppudu yesu ni nammukunna taruvatha after my believing in jesus christ and receiving him as the lord and savior after that every righteous act that you do is credited into your account right so don't do it for people evaro go ma vaadu ninu praise chestar ani cheyaku do it because god is looking at it and he is crediting your account do good do good in the name of jesus christ do good and it is accounted for everything is accounted for so we'll pray father we thank you here we are standing in your presence lord thanking you for the life that you've given to us and as your word says we take the uh, we take the testimonies of uh, lord uh, people who have uh, done righteous works oh god we take the examples of phinehas and uh, we take we take it we say and he was quiet he just saw there is something wrong he went and uh, intervened and uh, finished that came back and sat down and we remember him after thousands of years we remember him now and read it as a testimony and want that to happen in our lives you are a god who never forgets the place who never forgets one thing that we have done and when jesus came he said i will not forget a glass of water given to a child i will not give i will not forget yesu christo ochin tarvata than cheppadu nu oka chinna pilladiki nu manchi neellu ichina nenu marchipovanu ani cheppadu he never forgets god we serve a god who never forgets what we have done and where we have done done it on the day on the last day when when people have come when people come to the lord jesus tells this as an example he comes and uh, tells to the uh, he comes and tells he says many will come on that day right and we will leave that verse aside but uh, those people whom god is telling you have visited me in prison you have given me food you have given me clothes and uh, what were the people response god when did we give this when did we do this and uh, jesus replies he says if you have done to the least of them you have done to me this is god that we that we that we serve so church let's pray father we thank you we give you praise we give you glory we give you honor thank you so much for the life that you've given to us oh god you're such a wonderful god this life is given by you so it has to be blessed oh god it has to be blessed it has to be blessed nu ee jeevithanni nu vichav kabatti aashirvadanga maatrame untundi tanru ee aashirvadanga maatrame untundi tanru will be a blessing because nothing bad comes from you nothing bad comes from you you might be wondering my life is difficult my life is uh, uh, this my life is that remember believe that what god has given is blessed blessed and live in response to that a jeevitamu మరి కష్టంగా ఉంది నా జీవితం వ్యర్థంగా ఉంది నేను ఏం చేయలేకపోతున్నాను ఇంకోళ్ళకి నేను శాపంగా ఉంటున్నాను అని మీరు అనుకోగలరు కానీ గుర్తుంచుకోండి దేవుడు ఇచ్చిన జీవితము ఆశీర్వాదంగా మాత్రమే ఉంటుంది దాంట్లో నమ్మిక ఉంచుదాము దాంట్లో నమ్ముదాము దాంట్లో నమ్ముదాము బిలీవ్ ఇన్ దాట్ దట్ గాడ్ యూ హ్యావ్ గివెన్ దిస్ లైఫ్ టర్న్ ఇట్ ఇన్ టు ఏ బ్లెస్సింగ్ టర్న్ ఇట్ ఇన్ టు ఏ బ్లెస్సింగ్ ఒక టర్న్ ఇట్ ఇన్ టు ఏ బ్లెస్సింగ్ ఐ వన్స్ అగైన్ కమిట్ మై లైఫ్ టు యూ నా జీవితాన్ని పున నేను నీకు అర్పణగా నేను నీ వద్దకు తీసుకొస్తున్నాను తండ్రి దిస్ ఈజ్ మై లైఫ్ అండ్ లెట్ ఇట్ బి అన్ ఆఫరింగ్ టు యూ లెట్ ఇట్ బి అన్ ఆఫరింగ్ టు యూ జస్ట్ స్పీక్ యూ హార్ట్ హార్ట్ టు గాడ్ చర్చ్ జస్ట్ స్పీక్ టు యూ హార్ట్ టు గాడ్ 